See, this is how the devil works. When I tell y'all to have stuff ready, there's a reason. Because there's very few of us speaking the way I speak. Right. Take ministry serious, that's for everybody. Amen. Because we're in the last days when Bishop Drew J. Shear, the bishop of the Church of God in Christ, not only does his wife Karen Clark and Dorenda make music with Snoop Dogg and Beyonce, not only do they do that and they get a pass, now he's merging with the largest, if it's not the largest, it's the second largest cult in the world. The Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints is the Mormon. They have the gold Moroni. See, you know, I thank God for who I am because when I start talking to my wife in a different way, they be like, you know a little bit. My brother, he's famous for saying, you got a scripture for everything. And he wasn't being funny. He said, you got a scripture for everything. And it's amazing, and I thank God for what he's given me in these last days. Because I taught on Mormonism years ago. It was started by Joseph Smith, who said that the angel Moroni, who was a man who worked his way up to being an angel, the angel Moroni gave him golden tablets and the book of Abraham aside and apart from the Bible to guide people. He said that the angel Moroni and Jesus Christ and different ones appeared to him and gave him direction. Oh, by the way, all black people, according to Mormonism, are going to hell. Let me tell you about what else about Mormonism. Mormonism, they believe that Jesus Christ and Satan were brothers and are brothers. Let me tell you something else about Mormonism. This is just to name a few. They practice polygamy until the 1900s, so they say. But that's why all the sister wives and two and three husbands is all, are all based out of Utah. Yes. Let me tell you something else that's going to really blow your head across the creek. Because this is heresy. I said it last week that Bishop Sheard was a warlock. I believe in my heart that he is. I'm not changing it. It won't surprise me if he's a mason. Because he said, we are coming together for humanity. In the Masonic Lodge, we all had different beliefs. But we came together for a common good. Let me tell you why that's bad. Because the Bible, God broke up the Tower of Babel. Because everybody was trying to build their way to heaven. He said, let me confuse and confound. And then people went different places, different religions, different, different dialects. Let me teach you some heresy. Mormonism believes that God, the Father, was a man on another planet. He worked his way up to becoming God and is now our God for this realm. But there are other gods in other realms and people are God. Now I hope my former pastor. Yes, now you have preached against everything. You have preached against homosexuality. You have preached against everything except for racism. You have preached against homosexuality. You have preached against abortions. But let me tell you something. This equals, if not rivals, everything you've preached. Because now the church of God in Christ is merging with a cult that does not believe like we believe. 